<laughs> what? 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 What does it look like on camera? Why they all scabbed up? What were you doing? It was just like rough. Talk. He was giving that hot talk. <laughs> yeah. You guys ready for round two? Oh yeah, Brad right here. Yeah. Oh, oh no, Brad's here. <laughs> yeah. Oh. <laughs> Damn, Felipe is flaked on like there or what? Oh, uh, he calls me? Felipe, bro, we've been trying to play on this leg day forever or just even a workout to like film this stuff. And he calls me when I'm on my way over here. Keep in mind, we changed the time because of him. We were gonna 10 a.m. And then he hits me up last night and he's like, yo, can we do 11 please? And I'm like, sure, I guess, because I work today. So I'm like, I don't have all day. But he calls me, like, I'm on my way over I'm like eight minutes away. And he's like, Oh, bro, you're gonna hate me. I'm like, bro, you sound like a girl right now trying to cancel on a dude that she does not want to hang out with. Damn, lazy <laughs> ass. Guys, if that's what a girl tells you, oh, you're gonna <laughs> hate me and she last minute cancels on you, it's most likely because she doesn't, she doesn't want you, bro. I'm gonna just be honest. So. Damn, that's I'm the just, sauce? Huh? I said, that's the sauce? I'm gonna just be honest. Like, I'm trying to save y'all as well, you know what I'm saying? Like, save yourself, please. Um, yeah, what else? Give us one more. One more? Yeah, one more piece of advice. What's another way she cancels? She says she has plans with her mom or what? No, because sometimes that's valid. Like sometimes people actually... But you make plans with your mom like two weeks ahead, like a month prior. Sometimes, but it depends. Like, you know, especially like Mexican moms, you know, like last minute they'd be like, oh, you're, you need to come with me or like everybody <laughs> needs help. You know what I'm saying? You can't, yeah. say, you can't say no to your mom. That's true. Uh, another... I don't know. I feel like that's a top one. Yeah, that is. Like, like last week, you you've heard that before, huh? I definitely heard that many times. <laughs> um, I've definitely used that one before. That's but <laughs> crazy. Like you know, they just don't want to hang out and stuff. But hanging out is horrible. It's like it's a lot of effort, you know. Not even. All it all it takes is oh no, I can't hang out today. That's true though. That's true. <laughs> But it's like sometimes when you try and say like oh it's because you just want to keep him around and be make him decide huh no not just that but it's like some people don't take rejection well but also not just some people don't take rejection well some people don't know how to like reject and just be like oh this isn't for me like I, i'm not we're not aligning like this isn't gonna work out <laughs> you know what i'm saying because it could be that simple like it should be that simple like oh okay like i'm, I'm not really interested like, but it's because sometimes it has nothing to do with the person. It's just like it's not working out. But then it's better to just be straightforward than uh -huh. like lead it on. Because then those poor guys are going to be trying to be persistent. Yeah. And you're like whole time in your head, you're like, nah, I'm not feeling it. Just, guys, just say you're not feeling it. It's fine. <laughs> I would much rather, would you much rather have someone be like straight up with you and be like, yo, I'm not feeling you, honestly. No, I want someone I that's toxic. Oh. I personally would like for someone to be like, honestly, I'm not feeling this. I'm not fucking with it. Like, cool. But if you're giving mixed signals and just like ghosting or being weird, like I'm gonna be confused, you know? Yeah. What are the top five things you're looking for a guy? Oh, that's a hard question. What? That's a loaded question. Not even. Because there's a lot of like things that I look for. What are your top five then? I feel like he has to be a gentleman. He has to be a gentleman? Yeah. But like, oh, I feel like gentleman slash just like a good person. Uh huh. He's, he asked me what are the top. Uh, well, let's ask him too. What are the top five things you look for in a lady? Oh. <laughs> that she cheats, still talks to her ex. Wow, that's crazy work. Manipulates bro. you. That's Christian woman. No, that's what. That's what. A woman that that's puts what he God looks for. first. Ah. Good family background. Good morals. Uh. Mutual respect for each other. And just a woman that can grow in love. Boom. Oh. There you go. Hi, shit. <laughs> Bye. No matter what, and you're gonna get through. Yeah. It is. It, it'll be tough though. Um. So the second exercise is gonna be 20 burpee overhead press with the dumbbells. Yeah. 20 of them. So if you think you can do 20, fucking, we're getting 20 no matter what. You're gonna fucking get there. And then the last one is gonna be max clean. So yeah. you do cleans until it's fucking failure. Okay. And like each round, like for me, I did at 135, I got 10 every round. And that was like a push for me. So whatever will be a push for you at this weight, yeah. rip it. All right? Okay. Can we get water around? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm lightheaded. Yeah. All right, guys. We got Charlie on a Friday here today. Uh, he just got back from tour. He'll talk about it. 
and uh, yeah, we're about to put him through the fucking ringer. So that's right. Another yeah, another yeah, client we, going through. Yeah, about to go through the fucking ringer. He needs it. He needs to be fucking humbled. This dude was a. Uh, I think like a Division One, Division Two football player, kind of lost it. Obviously, being on tour, you know, life life hits you. But he hit me up. He was like, "Yo, Brad, I need to go through some shit." And I was like, "I got you." So we're putting him through. I, I did this workout today too. It's, it's uh, four different rounds, so it's a .25 mile run, 20 burpee overhead press, and then max cleans, whatever weight you want. Then it's a .5 mile run, 20 burpee overhead press, max cleans. .75 mile run. 20 burpee overhead press, max cleans, and then a one mile run, 20 burpee overhead press, max cleans, then a 1.25 mile run to cap it off. All in a row, with some break after each round, but. <laughs> You're trying to kill him, huh? But, oh yeah. Yeah, Charlie, you ready? I just told him that you're on tour, that you know, you're, you've been I out feel, of it. I feel crazy, even now. <sighs> like my head's like so light. Make, make sure you gotta make sure you're hydrating right now. Make, make sure you're staying hydrated. Yeah. But uh, you need this. You need I this. I might just need like five. Did they ever tell you that you look like the long lost nephew of Eminem? You think so? A little bit. I can see it a little. Yeah. All right. You, you need five. All right. Make sure. All right. Well, make sure you're make sure you're hydrated. Make sure you're hydrated. Yeah. All right. They're about to kill him, bro. Oh, I'm gonna fucking murder his ass. He needs it, bro. Sometimes you need a humbling. Like, like sometimes you just you need to get humbled. Honestly. Oh. <laughs> I feel like weird though. <laughs> like headed? Like my head's like, like really light. Oh yeah, it's definitely he, he has to hydrate himself. Get it, <laughs> bro. Take a minute, bro. Chill, bro. Chill. <laughs> All right, but you'll be ready to go in like five. Yeah, let me evaluate how I'm feeling right now. Oh, you gotta, oh, you gotta not do the workout. I, I feel like really lightheaded. But you have to understand like what I just did though. Like, <laughs> I guess, yeah, I mean, I've never been on tour. I don't really know. <laughs> You've been funny. on tour, huh? No, no, not, no. He was like on tour, on tour, on tour. Like, what was it? Like every night? Yeah. Like every night, whatever. I, I don't know what goes down. But. <laughs> I don't know, I never like felt like that. I guess I also haven't done cardio in probably like a year. What are you feeling though? Like, like lightheaded as fuck. Oh, you know you're doing the workout, right? You're gonna do it. I'm gonna see what's good. I'm not getting you out of it. No matter what, we're just we're gonna get through. Okay. Trust. <laughs> Trust. Another victim. Shake on it. Shake on it. Charlie? Hold on, I don't know yet. Bro, that's crazy. Hold on. That's crazy. I just feel crazy. Like, I, like no, like, brother, brother. Bro, put water on your face. I know, it's like weird though. Are you like nervous or like? It's just like, I, I started like getting like hella lightheaded. Like feeling like I was gonna like pass out. I feel like we can't back out of the workout. <laughs> What if you were feeling this way before a playoff football game? Would you back out? Uh, I just don't want to pass the fuck out here. You're not gonna pass out. Do have, you have a history of passing out? Yeah. Oh, actually? Yeah. That's why I'm like... You're not even drinking water. Where's the water? <laughs> like I'd like... Intro workout in there. So what is intro workout? It's like BCAAs, kind of like keeps you fueled during your workout. Oh, amino acids? Amino acids, yeah, and it like, yeah. I don't know, also like kind of pumps me too. Brad, what's up there? What's up there? What's uh, up there? Charlie has to dip. I love you all. He's got his dip. <laughs> he, uh, yeah, yeah. He's, he's feeling it. So, hey, you gotta, you gotta listen to your intuition, if, you know. You got a dip, you got a dip, but hey, it's all good. At least he came, showed up, put in, put in some effort. But uh, he'll be back tomorrow morning. He'll be back tomorrow morning. We shook on it. We shook on it. So he's coming back. What do we vlog for? You just fucking go. I think you should. You should gonna train him. You should train James. He's gonna come. James won't be able to handle that workout. If my my torn rotator cuff is like fucked up, but when it's healed, I'll do it. Shake on it. I'm 100 percent. Shake on it. Whatever, I'll do whatever you want me to do, I'll do it. And you can like, you know how to like hang clean and... What? It's, it's, I'm not, no camera, it's actually fucked. I told you that before. Yeah. I can't even lift, it's really bad. Sorry, you can't even, like, what's your POA and plan of action? Uh, right now, it's my, my split is legs and yap. And then Tuesday, I do abs and come here and talk to people. Wednesday, legs and abs, and that's it. 
I really, I, I really can't. I've tried to like light, do light shit, and it's only getting worse. So I don't do it. You gotta work on the mobility of it, like every single day. But like, okay, a genuine question: If you tear something, does okay, it stretch it? No. They're not gonna, I've got my shoulder checked out before. They don't do anything.